In this video, Monkey puts up with some humans in his neighborhood. People drive around and around in circles, and we visit a load of waterfalls. The trip is across the mountains of the Izu Peninsula and then down along the coast and back to the hotel. This is one of the oddest toilets I've ever seen. It's shaped like a cockroach, I think. Pretty cool here. It's a private bath that looks like it's from Hobbiton in the Lord of the Rings. Is this for a bus stop? Kumomi Onsen bus stop. It's not only just a bus stop with a shelter, it's got its own ensuite toilet. You look inside, it's got some pictures, it's got photos of the animals, it's got a couple of seats. It's got a walking stick, in case you missed the last bus. It's got a couple of extra seats here, and a calendar. It's bigger than my first apartment in Tokyo. I think I might move in here. This is a definite 9.5 out of 10. After the first couple of climbs, come to this little port town called Matsuzaki. A load of the houses are in this really unique style guy who owns this place let us come and take a look in you've got all of the Japanese dolls from coming of age day just next to the shrine they have a trap to catch wild boar Hopefully we don't bump into too many of them today. Nasty little things. Some cherry blossom trying to break through. Found this place just before Minami Izu called the South Cafe. Got myself a Philly cheesesteak sandwich. Looks pretty good. Troy got himself a raspberry smoothie, which actually looks really good. I'm pretty jealous I didn't buy one, actually. Across this little temple called Koyoji, it's got hundreds and hundreds of Buddha statues here. There's loads of them. Getting in a bit closer, so you can see them close up. And if you look closely, they've all got these little Buddhas with them, just next to them. So those are the mountains we climbed over this morning in the distance, just here. And then we've cycled along the coast, up and down those roads there. Really nice, really nice day today. 20 degrees, beautiful. Some of the climbing out of Minamizu is pretty tough. But at the top, you're rewarded with some of these great views. Beautiful. Dinner, we got baby squid, we've got daikon, we've got half of the ocean, we've got some vegetables, we've got some soup, should be quite nice. We've got fried octopus, which also looks great. Looks great, hey, Troy. On the way home, we stopped in at Monkey Bay. Monkey Bay is exactly what it sounds like. A bay with a beach and a load of monkeys. You can mingle freely with the monkeys, but no food's allowed. There are about 130 monkeys in total. This is the boss monkey. And here he is enjoying the day, looking out at sea. Finally, in a Shimo shrine. Apart from the entrance, which is quite normal for shrines, 
The inside is really strange. It's got loads of weird carvings. The little shrines are a little bit weird as well. The main spiritual thing in the shrine seems to be the tree, but the tree looks like it's from a horror movie. 